Let's face it, the cost of owning a super yacht is more than you will ever earn in your life. Next to a private jet, owning a super yacht is the ultimate status symbol. It is only accessible to the world's richest billionaires. What will you do if you could own the super yacht for a week? Would you use it to travel somewhere or just use the swimming pool, hot tub, and take the chopper to fly around the city you're in? Or maybe sit on the deck and watch the people on the shore, admiring the yachts. You can do it all with these stupidly expensive yachts I'm going to show you now. And while you're on the yacht, subscribe to our channel. This will keep you from sinking. Number 10, Lady Moira, $210 million. According to rumors, Saudi Arabian wealthy businessman Nasser El Rashid is the owner of Lady Moira. The yacht, which was constructed by Blom and Voss in Germany, has a gold plating and can accommodate up to 30 guests in addition to 60 crew members. The yacht is distinctive in that it has 24 karat gold lettering for its name on the outside. Other luxurious amenities offered by this stupidly expensive yacht include a helicopter, a 75-foot Viscount Linlay dining table, and a swimming pool with a retractable roof. A special hydraulic platform coated in sand that slides out of one side of this yacht and can be modified to sit at the water's edge, which adds to its distinctiveness. Number 9. Al Mirkab, $250 million Al Mirkab, the 2009 Motor Yacht of the Year winner, is rumored to be owned by Hamad bin Jassim bin Jaber Al Thani, a former Prime Minister of Qatar. Peter Schiffbahn wie Elsflit of Germany is the main man behind its construction. Tim Haywood, an architect, and Andrew Winch, a designer, are responsible for this extravagant construction. And this stupidly expensive yacht is 436 feet long and is composed of steel. With a top speed of 37.6 km per hour, the yacht offers 10 spacious apartments for visitors, each of which has a bathroom, living area, and bedroom. In addition to this, Al Mirkab has a large range of water sports equipment, a theater, and an indoor pool, outdoor bars, jacuzzis, and sunbathing areas. Up to 25 guests and 55 staff members can be accommodated in this yacht. Number 8. Dilbar – $256 million Dilbar, a yacht built by the German Lursen shipyard with a top speed of 42 km per hour, is thought to have been constructed for Russian billionaire Alisher Uzmanov. The yacht, which has an aluminum superstructure and a displacement steel hull, can accommodate 40 guests in addition to its more than 80 crew members. The swimming pool that this stupidly expensive yacht offers is one of the most prestigious features because it is reputed to be the largest super yacht pool. The yacht has two helipads in addition to the pool, and its interior capacity is 3,800 square meters. Number 7. Al Said – $300 million With a displacement of 15,850 tons and a length of 508 feet, this yacht is reputedly owned by a member of the Omani royal family and is the largest yacht in the world. The yacht has a performance theater that can hold a 50-piece orchestra and can accommodate up to 70 guests in addition to its 154 crew members. This yacht travels at a comfortable speed of 47 kilometers per hour. Number 6. Dubai – $400 million Another extravagant yacht, which is also rumored to be owned by a member of the royal family of the UAE, Dubai, is 531 feet long when it comes to its size. It was built by Blom & Voss. The exteriors of this stupidly expensive yacht have been designed by Andrew Winch, while its interiors have been designed by Platinum Yachts. The super yacht can accommodate 155 guests, including the crew, and has a mosaic swimming pool, a spiral staircase, a helipad, sunbathing places, and many jacuzzis. The yacht's deck includes a split-level owner's deck, a big social area and salon, a variety of VIP areas, and guest suites. The interiors of the yacht are dominated by bright colors. Number 5. Motor Yacht A – $440 million This stupidly expensive luxury yacht, allegedly owned by Russian businessman Andrei Melnichenko, was built by architect Martin Francis and designed by Felipe Stark to resemble a stealth warship or submarine. It can accommodate 14 guests and 42 crew members and was constructed by the Blom & Voss shipyard in Kiel. The 400-foot-long yacht's interiors cover 24,000 square feet and include a 2,500-square-foot master bedroom and disco, as well as six guest bedrooms with movable walls that can be divided into four spacious staterooms. The interior and furniture of this yacht are decorated with mirrored surfaces, while French crystal is used for the glasses and dinnerware. In addition, it boasts a helicopter hangar, a 30-foot speedboat, and three swimming pools, one of which has a glass bottom and is located over the yacht's disco. 
Number 4. Azam $600 million Azam, which is rumored to be owned by a member of the UAE royal family, is the most complicated and difficult yacht ever created. According to its designers, with a speed of 35 kilometers per hour, this 590-foot-long yacht is regarded as one of the quickest. The elegant interiors were created by French interior decorator Christophe Leone and Nauda Yacht created the exteriors. With a combined 35,048 kilowatt of power from two gas turbines and two diesel engines, this stupidly expensive yacht can move quickly through warm and shallow water. Number 3. Streets of Monaco – $1.1 billion Streets of Monaco is a 500-foot-long yacht that has tiny versions of famous Monaco buildings such as the Monte Carlo Casino, Hotel de Paris, La Rascas, and a swimming pool that resembles a beach. It is often referred to as a floating city. Its appearance was created by opulent yacht, and its interior was created by filthy rich boaters. The yacht's three-story opulent suite boasts a private elevator, an office, a living room, terraces, and sun decks with jacuzzis. This yacht is spread across three stories. In addition, it has seven guest suites, each of which has an attached dressing room, bathroom, and balcony. In addition, the yacht has a grilling area, a miniature waterfall, a stunning cafe bar with an underwater view, helicopters, and submarines. Number 2. Eclipse – $1.5 billion Owner of the Eclipse, the second largest yacht in the world is Roman Abramovich, a Russian billionaire. This yacht has two helipads, 24 guest cabins, a disco hall, two swimming pools, and hot tubs in addition to an intruder detection system and missile detection system. It was created by Terence Distale and manufactured by the German company Blom & Voss. This 533-foot-long yacht also features a mini-submarine that can dive to a depth of 50 meters. The yacht's master suite and bridge are equipped with armor plating and shatterproof windows. Additionally, the yacht has an anti-paparazzi shield made of lasers that scan the surroundings. And finally, the most stupidly expensive yacht in the world, number one, History Supreme, $4.8 billion. The History Supreme, the most expensive yacht in the world and purportedly owned by Malaysia's richest man, Robert Nock, is made entirely of solid gold. This 100-foot-long, most expensive yacht was constructed over the course of three years using 10,000 kilograms of real gold and platinum and was created by renowned British luxury designer Stuart Hughes. This yacht is decorated with gold and platinum throughout, including the base, dining room, deck, railways, stairway, and anchor. The master bedroom of the luxury yacht is the most opulent feature, featuring a meteorite rock wall and a statue carved from an actual Tyrannosaurus rex bone. The master bedroom is embellished with a rare 18.5 carat diamond encrusted liquor bottle and a 68 kilogram 24 carat gold Aqua Vista panoramic wall aquarium. Helicopter pads, diamonds, gold, T-Rex bones. Wow. Let's come back to our senses for a bit. Although this all sounds like a Hollywood movie, you will probably see these super yachts around these mega buildings in Dubai. Check them out in the next video. You will surely like that too. Don't forget to subscribe for more such stupidly expensive things from around the world. And do hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our important video updates. So like and subscribe to the channel because that's not expensive.